greetings people of the internet uh... yeah if you were expecting a view for warriors of kyoshi sorry in my last review i forgot about this episode and why did i forget i mean i mean we were introduced to momo and just so much stuff went down and i'm, I'm just sorry Next episode, I know for a fact, will be Warriors of Kyoshi, though. So, yeah. I showed this in the end, at the end of the last one. See you in the Southern Air Temple. But, I didn't. So sorry about that. But anyways, all those mistakes put aside. On with this review. <clears throat> oh my goodness. I, I said Aang, you know, that's tough for having him take all that in, you know, when he's just, you know, all that he's been in the ice for that long, but now he's got to not only take that in, but that is all his people are dead. There ain't no airbenders left. And he hasn't technically counted because he's the Avatar. There is not one person who is sorely an airbender. Yeah, he, he, he can bend air, but he can also bend water, earth, and fire, so he don't really count. In my book, okay, you don't. Not at all. Actually, yes, you do. Not. No, it's not. Not at all. But you, you don't count as the last airman to me. Okay, I'm sorry. You are the last of the air gnome ass, but not the last airbender. Sorry, but don't change the name of the other of the show. The show's still great. Um. And ooh, yes. Uh, <laughs> the comedy finally is kicking in. Um, uh, with Sokka, like, no wonder the flames smell so good. <laughs> and, um, uh, all the, he, he, all, he's there and he's like, food, food, I need my food. <laughs> oh, and my honor count has been going up. I went up three tick marks on that four. I thought I was only going to go, like, one. Man. And uh, it's not just the word honors, like, um, uh, even, like Hiro said, even, um, uh, in exile, my nephew's more honorable. I, I still count that. Um, uh, <clears throat> and what else? Oh, yeah, Momo. Everyone loves Momo. You know, he's like, like, lamer, dimmer. <laughs> still a sucker. Yeah, but still, that's just a lot of take in and another thing I did not I did not like about this episode it's not just sorely about this episode like if you're watching it first you wouldn't really catch this but the only avatar we know that was signaled when you know Aang went into the avatar state was Avatar Roku. We saw someone meditating in the Earth Kingdom in front of a poster and we saw something in the Northern Water Tribe. It, it might have been Avatar Karuk because you know he was from the Northern Tribe but we don't really know so I don't like how we weren't introduced to those avatars. But, anyways, it's still a great episode as all of them are. Except for one. I don't like it all. It's just. I hate watching but I'm gonna have to for this. Oh, and I've also come to the conclusion of actually doing 61, because I was thinking. The more I was thinking about it, like, you know what? If I do into part two, into all the parts, into one whole, I'm, I'm gonna leave stuff out. I'm. I'm gonna go over over my time limits. I want. I'm trying to keep these under 10 minutes, and so yeah, I'm gonna have 61 reviews. Um. So yeah, um. And all the, the statues of all the avatars. I noticed that the Earthbending avatar next to um uh, Roku. Go back and watch the episode. It's not Kyoshi. It's a man man with a sword. Not a woman with fans. What? What the heck? In the next episode, it's all about Kyoshi. So, I don't know what they were doing there. I really do not know what they were doing there. <laughs> but anyways, it's still a good episode. Um, uh, what was I about to say? Uh, oh, yes. The Agni Kai with Zuko and Xiao. That was awesome. That was just pure amazing action. I really love the music that went along with it too. And I 
do really think that Zhao knows that Zuko, what Zuko is capable of, is like, like he says, he's like, like you're just a child, like you can't stop me, like you know. But he says you'll be held here, like you're not getting another chance. Like the, the capturing the Avatar is far more, far too important for a teenager. And he, he yet yeah, right before then, he mocked him for being beaten by a twelve year old. Like, like this twelve year old is serious danger. You can't handle him. Like, like you just got beat by a twelve year old. You stuff. Like, dude, make up your freaking mind. Just. And hold on, I gotta take a drink, and I don't want to censor for labels. And that was Soda X. Ha <laughs> ha. You're not knowing what I just drank. Ooh, ah, ah, ah. No. When? <sighs> Anyways. Good episode, and... Um, uh, you see, he, Iro says, Do you know what? Do you remember what happened last time you duel a master? I will never forget. We don't know who the master is yet. Um, uh, we all have a pretty good idea, but we don't know who it was yet. Uh, how we got, you know, the star on that side of the space. But yeah, and uh, gosh, I feel like there was more I wanted to say. Ah, yes. We finally get an insight to the uncle's love for tea. See you guys for Warriors of Kiyoshi. Bye.